Hello everyone and welcome to this weekend vlog. Honestly, I am so excited to be vlogging for you guys. So I feel like pre-lockdown, I really got into like a good routine of doing a weekly vlog and I absolutely loved it. And then, yeah, lockdown happened and I thought it really wouldn't be very interesting to see how many times can Gemma go to the fridge in one day, literally. And I feel like obviously as restrictions have been lifted a little bit and things are starting to return back to normality i would do a weekend vlog for you give you a little break from all the fashion hauls and give my bank balance a little break too so i feel like i've actually had a pretty productive morning so far i've been to the post office i got a coffee i haven't had breakfast yet it is oh my god three minutes to one um <laughs> but I'm just waiting for Lewis to come over. I haven't seen him all week, so I'm super excited to see him. And yeah, we're going to HomeSense, so I thought that in itself is a reason for this vlog alone. I really wanna pick up some like cute autumn-y bits. You know, I'm thinking mugs, candles, you know, the full, full shebang. So Lewis has the car. I mean, I'm talking as if I am literally made of money, like make it rain. <laughs> literally no. I just wanna get, I just wanna have a look around. I haven't been to home since like for the longest time. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna take you along with me this weekend. I think tonight, weather dependent because i really don't like going to the cinema when it's warm outside i just i just can't it's i don't know if you guys are the same it's just something i can't do so weather dependent we might go to every man cinema there's one in crystal palace which i think is the closest one and lewis has the car uh this weekend so that will be nice and yeah but again weather dependent because tomorrow is supposed to be like 27 degrees so i think uh as a house we're gonna have a barbecue which should be super super fun so what i'll do is i'm gonna go downstairs and make breakfast now so i will or shall i say brunch because it's literally lunchtime i'll show you my little dress i picked this up from topshop i had my eye on it for such a long time so this is the little topshop dress i had my eye on it for the longest time and it came back in stock yesterday if you follow me on instagram you may have seen that i did share it on my stories i think it was friday night it's just such a cute leopard print dress it's so timeless i love these little kind of wrap tea dresses although i was walking down the road earlier and i literally it went like that and i flashed my knickers i was like great don't really want to be catcalled but that's literally asking to be catcalled isn't it so i'll link it if they still have it in stock definitely pick it up it's 22.99 and i've just put it on with my nike air force one trainers which honestly i have been living in and then these cute little nike socks so again i will try and link those for you but i know they literally sell out like hotcakes and then i've got the what are these daisy jewelry so that's daisy jewelry and that's daisy jewelry but i will oh and also my rings yeah and my rings are also daisy jewelry very basic breakfast here i've got eggs so two eggs and then i made it with these uh, egg whites which come in a carton and then i cooked it in coconut oil which i haven't done for a while actually and then Cholula, this is so good if you can get your hands on it. So a bit millennial, but yeah, really, really good. We are here. So just got to home sense, guys. Look who I'm with, baby. As enthusiastic as ever. <laughs> it's such a nice day today as well. We were gonna get a nice coffee, but Lewis missed the turning. So I think we'll um, get one after. Oh, there's a little there as well. I didn't know that. That used to be Argos. Um, yeah, after we go into home set. Have you got a mask? Oh, no. no. Yeah, there's one there on the back seat. That's literally the most widely said thing in 2020. Have you got your mask? So yeah, I'll show you what I get. Hopefully, I want to get some candles. Some <laughs> yawning. And um, yeah, are you excited about the autumn stuff, baby? Yes. What? Huh? What? What? What exactly about autumn? What do you mean? 
Come on! Yay! No, no, what? What did you get, baby? Oat milk. Looks so good. Frappuccino. With yeah. Caramel. Whoop! And I got an iced oat latte with like loads of ice. Mine looks nice. Yeah, yours does. But I got one of these reusable cups which I've wanted for ages. So we came to the Starbucks in Collier's Wood. I got an iced oat latte this way, this way with hazelnut syrup. Guys, I'm literally the worst girlfriend ever. I said to Lewis, I was like, <laughs> I'm not, I didn't mean to do it. So I was like, baby, try this for reference. Cause he actually really likes iced oat coffees now. And I was like, try this as so an bad. iced oat she hazelnut so latte. She decided to take it out and film it. <laughs> Capture the but event he, he's got a nut allergy, so whoops, I forgot. Guys, look at these cushions. So nice. So $29.99. I think that's really, really cute. I'm gonna leave you to talk to yourself when you go. <laughs> gonna what? I'll leave you to talk to yourself. You're so rude. Are you going? Okay. This is really, really nice as well. It's like velvet, $39.99. I'd love it in another colour though, this is like a kind of snotty lime. Look at the kind of autumn Halloween star. This is so cute, it's $7.99. Oh my god, look! Look how nice all of these are as well. I don't actually really know what they are but this is really really cute love this one at the back look this is really really cute as well so guys i've lost lewis um he got bored and went off to find himself some chinos so yeah, it looks like I'm in Home Sense Align, which I don't mind because I'm totally in my element. Look at these. Like basket things. I actually really wanted a new laundry basket, so I think I'm going to pick one of these up for sure. I really like that one and that one. Oh my god, this one. How much is this? $39.99 Cheers guys So a really good candle selection but they don't seem to have any autumn candles, which is really upsetting. Also, I don't really know how I'm supposed to sniff this, like... Christmas spice. Mm. So, I found one autumn thing. be quite nice for coffee so how much is this a little bit disappointing on the mug front i was hoping to find like an autumn mug and they don't have any i have seen this one though which i really really like and it's 4.99 so do i need this guys i don't know i don't know if i'm wowed by it I was hoping to find like a pumpkin one, but that's probably like the most autumnal and it's a hedgehog. Some of these things are so pretty, like this glass tray and then this candlestick and these things as well are really, really nice. So they have all these like cozy throws. I really, really like this one. But I can't find a price on it. So this one's also really, really cute. How much are you? It's free apparently. Guys, look how adorable this is. So it's 
$29.99. I feel like I might have to get it. So pretty. So guys, I'll show you the bits that I picked up from HomeSense. I got this bedside table, which I think is really, really cute. And it was reduced to 73 pounds. So really nice and spacious as you can see I'm gonna pop it here because I hate that Ikea one and then I got this laundry basket and then I got some bedding so wait this laundry basket was $19.99 and then this bedding which looks like that this was 34.99 so actually quite spenny but it's 100 percent cotton and then i got this candle which smells amazing so it was 6.99 and then i got a cute little throw for the sofa downstairs so this is nice and cozy and autumnal not gonna lie though bit disappointed no autumn candles like none no autumn mugs so maybe i've gone a little bit too early um because i was expecting there to be loads but i've got some cute things anyway and i was looking for like a pumpkin spice candle or like a pumpkin butter candle or just something really autumnal but unfortunately i didn't have any but really happy with what i got and that bedside table was reduced from 99.99 to 73 not the biggest bargain but i feel like it looks really really expensive so yeah productive saturday so far i've had a little bit too much caffeine though i need some water i feel incredibly dehydrated but i'm really chuffed with my new little flask thing i've been looking for one of those for ages i even asked in the central london starbucks and they didn't have any so yeah managed to find that one in Collier's Wood. It's chicken night tonight. It's chicken night. This is the chef. <laughs> what up? But look guys at this chicken. Oh my god that looks better than KFC. This is double D's. <laughs> double D's. Oh my god is this the sauce as well? That's uh, soon to be fried up there. So sticky Korean? Sticky Barbecue. Korean chicken. Guys look at that. Feast your eyes to your eyes although i'm a bit alarmed about all that oil but <laughs> we, don't look at the oil. we won't talk about that guys look at this chicken oh my god so these are loaded what are they blue cheese sweet potato fries and hot sauce, and hot sauce. not for me because i don't like blue cheese these are mine look cute little dish but oh my god banging and now it's recording so today i've got a tanqueray and gin. It's got a bit of a easy peeler in it. It's fantastic. We've had some fantastic chicken. Look at the oil. Look at the oil on the boy. Oi, oi. And over here we've got Mr. Personal Trainer. The loved up couple. Oh my God. And this is going to go on my vlog tonight because you're all lovely people. Up the chairs. Good evening guys. So we just arrived at Cineworld and we literally thought that it was closed even though we checked the time so it's 20 quarter to 10 it's really late we are going to go and see tenant so i will let you know what it's like i've got on comfy attire i'll link it for you i love this misguided sweatshirt and lewis is currently in mcdonald's asking if an apple pie is gluten free um i don't think it is but I'm actually stuffed. I don't even want anything to eat, but I'll let you know how the film goes. Well, has it? Yeah. Oh. Did you get a nice bar? Yeah. What about? Huh? Soft jellies. Um, sour patches or wine gum or something. Sour patch. Yeah. 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 Oh, in. See, this is why I don't eat dinner. I don't need dinner. <laughs> Get my veggies in in the morning. My sweets in at night. And I'm good. Sounds like a balanced diet, baby. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Balance. Yay. I can't eat it with this on anyway. Like, right, how am I supposed to eat that? Right. Good morning. 
Okay. Hey, baby. <laughs> oh my god, that makes my eye wrinkle. Don't do that. I'm out of focus. You're gonna get in for a thumbnail. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> Alright guys, it's going to be a screen 13 over on that side, yeah? Thank you. Thank you, enjoy Thank you, catch you in a bit more. Currently double half the drinks. Thank you, kind of just drop it there, please. Oh, sorry. We're trying to just keep the contact. Yeah, fair enough. Understand. Thank you. <laughs> Nine and ten. Thank you. Uh, you're welcome. Very welcome. Thank you. So this is our first time back in the cinema since when? You got my bad side. Oh sorry. All right, fashion blogger. <laughs> <laughs> so first time back in the cinema since before COVID. This is crazy. This lighting is not doing anything for me, but we'll let you know how the film is. See you on the other side. Guys, I might as well say good morning to you now because it is half past 12. That was a long ass film. Um, what did you think, baby? It's all right. It's all right. Crash, yeah. it, I found it incredibly confusing. So, if any of you are going to watch it, it is a really long film and my pea brain still doesn't really 100% understand it. Liz oh. had to explain it to me. Um, it's so long, but. Robert Patterson's in it. Pardon? Good. Yeah, no, it was good. Robert Patterson's in it. He's really, really good. Because I just remember him in Twilight just being really creepy and weird. But in that, he's actually good. And um, who's the other guy called? Um, Washington. Washington. Something D. John. D yeah. John, we were saying, is it Denzel's son? No, no it's actually it's not. But I said that. But um, oh. <laughs> I reckon... <laughs> <laughs> I reckon he's actually going to be the um, the next Bond. Yeah. I actually think he will, but Lois said that it's going to be Idris. His... Idris. Idris Elba. I'm absolutely stuffed. We ate so much popcorn and sweets and a Tango yeah. ice blast, which is actually called an oh. icy now. God, Lois is tired, clearly. And my periods come on really bad and I need a hot water bottle. I've got really, really bad cramps. So heading home now there was something i wanted to tell you oh yeah so i think one of the members of staff at the cinema at cineworld saw me vlogging with my camera and i had put my camera in my bag and then on the floor in the cinema and then i looked over and there was like two people standing and i said lewis like are they like gonna come over and tell us off? And then one of them came over to me and was like, do you have a camera? And I was like, yeah, it's in my bag. And he was like, can you put it on the floor? I think he thought that I was trying to record the film. Like I actually wasn't. I was just obviously vlogging as I went into the cinema, but I didn't even think about that. Um, oh, what's going on here? I'm rowdy. <laughs> Anyways, heading home now. So we'll probably speak to you tomorrow. Good morning everyone. Say good morning. Good morning. <laughs> it's actually not good morning, it's one o'clock um, and we are just off to the gym. Excuse the state of my face, cannot be bothered to put on any makeup. <laughs> I've had such bad period pains. Um, yeah, so love that for me. I go to the gym. It's really warm today. It's actually such a nice day. I think we're gonna have a barbecue. Left, no, next road, I think. Oh. Um, yeah, I think we're gonna have a barbecue when we get back because it's such a nice day. Although I'm not really feeling anything. Um, said really bad period pains so off to the gym now i don't know what i'm gonna do probably something quite light push pull um so for people that don't know what push pull is everyone will know no they won't some people have, know. yeah but a lot of people dm me saying what's push pull so push would be push. like chest pushing's pushing <laughs> pulling's pulling but pulling so is like that you, anything yeah push anything you um Shoulders on push. Shoulders on push. Okay. You can do shoulders on pull as well. So. 
Okay, well. Yeah, an upright rows. Yeah, okay, shoulder. upright rows, shoulders. When you're doing shoulder, military press, press, you're pushing and doing shoulders as well. So. Okay. Well, cool. Push, and push. Lewis is sponsored by Gymshark today. <laughs> oh, I'm so bloated. This is why I've got this like big baggy long sleeve thing on because. What did he, do you want to say to you? God, some people are so rowdy. I don't know, she said something to you. Oh, I don't know, I don't know. Rowdy. Yeah. Huh. Those Sunday dry, like drivers are out today. A not very exciting Sunday, just having a chilled one. Um, probably yeah. should make the most of the weather, but yeah. Oh, look at those pretty light leaks. Very nice. Baby. Like a little three-year-old. So guys, I've been a very, very bad vlogger. Um, it's now half past five and we've just had a barbecue. I'm absolutely stuffed. So this is the remains of what was left. So there was some chicken we put on the barbecue, some, oh, what is that? Salt and chili belly pork, I think, and then some chorizo sausages and some homemade garlic bread. Look at that sun. Oh, I'm absolutely stuffed. if this vlog has been a little bit disjointed i feel like yesterday was kind of like a more productive fun day and then today has just been a bit all over the place so yeah um i'm probably gonna just end the vlog here it's sunday night it is three minutes past nine and lewis has gone back home now and i am basically i've just made myself a mint tea um, and I've got some water I might I think I might just tidy my room a little bit because it's a bit messy I've got some washing that I need to put away I might move my new bedside table that I got from home since I showed you over to here and I was going to change my bed sheets because I love getting into bed on a Sunday with fresh bed sheets but I'm thinking that I'm going to fake tan tomorrow I am going to have a shower and scrub it all off and I found personally from experience it always goes on better when you apply it the day after you after you've exfoliated and shaved so i'm gonna do that um and oh my god tomorrow i'm getting my first brace fitted so i'm having my bottom one put on first um so that's going to be a clear brace i'm having that put on tomorrow i think my appointment's at 10 past three so yeah i'll probably be vlogging the process to be honest um i'm actually a little bit nervous because i've had like really i've heard very mixed things i've heard that um it really hurts and then other people have said like it's absolutely fine like you've got nothing to worry about so i'm just hoping that it doesn't hurt and then what am i doing i've got like lewis's birthday coming up so it's my dad's birthday on uh, wednesday the 16th and then Lewis's birthday um, the week after. So yeah, I'm just kind of going to go like organise and get things going like with that. Like get the ball rolling with things like that. Um, but yeah, I hope that you've enjoyed this vlog. I'm going to finish it off here. Um, and yeah, have a lovely week guys. And hopefully I'll see you again soon in another vlog. So have a lovely week. Love you lots. And yeah. Bye guys.